Uh, I am Rafael Monserrate. I am uh, the director of Falcon. I am Troy Halva. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm Troy Hall. I'm one of the writers, actors, and producers. That was nice. Thanks. Thanks. I'm Kevin Logie, another writer, actor, producer. And I'm Rindu Chandra. I'm one of the producers. So it's a, uh, a hilarious and moving story about a family in Buffalo, New York in 1987. Uh, parents have been together for 30 years, and on the night before Thanksgiving, they take their kids out, who are all in their 20s, to make a big announcement. The announcement is that they're getting a divorce, and now they have to spend their last Thanksgiving together in a civilized manner as they possibly can. And they really have to deal with each other. All the characters are dealing with some inner conflicts. The family's kind of falling apart, and they're really struggling to, to keep it together. Really. My parents got a divorce when I was 26. So it was really... It's funny. <laughs> it's hilarious. All the tears <laughs> and the crying. Um, no, it was... It, it, Troy and I were trying to put a sketch comedy show together, and... Well, one day after, it was a couple months after hearing the news, and I sat down and told the story that happened between my parents, and we just started to write and create, and it, these characters started to come to life, and it turned into the it was story. Just more, it was more of a, yeah. you know, we thought, okay, we'll go, and we'll, we'll make this sketch comedy show, and it'll be fun, it'll be a way for us to work, but it just the enormity I guess of the of what was going on for Kevin especially with with the divorce it was just there were so much more serious aspects to it as well so it wasn't like we're going to do a sketch comedy show that was made people cry and laugh because that's you know I don't I've never seen that um, so we're like you know what let's let's make a screenplay let's try a screenplay so it was our you know it was kind of therapy for him and definitely I got to dabble in the you know, being Freud a little bit. More Dr. Why Finch. Why did you try to make love to your mother? That's so, never actually That's happened. why you divorced. <laughs> Sorry. By terrible. the way, this was a blast uh, working on set. You can imagine. These guys are absolutely <laughs> hilarious. And uh, it was, you know, we shot this in 18 days, um, which was an incredible, you know, a very tough schedule. But it was very, very light and uh, incredibly, these guys were very close as a family and, and really sort of comes across, I think, in the film. But these guys really kept it fun and uh, lively. And, and uh, you know, it's a great set to be on, for sure, for yeah. sure. I can't really think of, maybe there were a couple of hairy moments where it might have gotten a little tense, but most of the time, I mean, everyone, yeah. the whole crew, we had a 40-person crew, everyone was joking around, everyone was having a good time. It was a great energy, you know, and the, Well, the it. great thing, too, was that this project was, a, for us, it was a lot of firsts. So it was Raf's first feature, our first screenplay, my first uh, feature as an actor, her first production as the producer, and so it was like, we didn't have any rules. We could kind of do whatever we wanted. So it was, and it was, it was the first time we made love. <laughs> <laughs> you were so rough. <laughs> we, we met doing, uh, there's UCB, Price Citizens Brigade. We were taking classes there and, and, and did some shows, and we kind of, at a certain point, we broke off and wanted to write our own thing. So we, we started doing that. The, the whole process, like up to now, has been like four years. We took our time writing the script, then we shot a trailer uh, to raise money, inspired by the, the Coen brothers, because Blood Simple is a comedy. I don't know if you need that. It's right. not. Um, but we, uh, yeah. So the the whole process, uh, the shooting and editing and everything, we've been we've been working together for four years. Yeah. So it's been pretty. Uh, it's been a good journey. Um, you know, people have been talking in the last year or two about independent film and where it's gone and maybe it's dead. Um, but I don't think it is dead. I think that you know we we made this film outside of the studios. We did, we. The, the biggest challenge in any kind of independent production is finding the right people. Um, and I think that's what we spent a lot of time doing because we didn't have tons and tons of money to throw around. Um, it was really selecting the right people, the right DP, the right um, crew, the right cast. And every single person who came on board on our project loved the script. So that's something we felt when we were making it together in Buffalo. We you know the other the other cool thing too about everyone that came on board was 
that not only did they offer us their their skill, but they off, also offered us a discounted rate so that we could use the money for other things. I mean, you know, Jay O'Sanders and Kathleen Quinlan both came on and, and worked for scale, I mean, off the merit of the script, you know, and they were amazing. But that obviously helped us. That gave us a little bit something extra that we could walk around and say, yeah, Academy Award nominee Kathleen Quinlan is in our movie and she worked for Peanuts, literally. Wow. I gave her a bag of peanuts <laughs> and she ate them. Yeah, and a real, real team effort. Yeah. Real collaboration, uh, just from every, like you were saying, from everybody involved. Uh, that's what's special about the film. And that's why I think we, we really believe it. It's a lot of heart. You feel it uh, when you see it. Uh, yeah. A lot of heart. And I think, I think we want to, you know, prove to, to any, you know, aspiring filmmaker out there that you just need to persevere, you need to, you know, keep going forward, uh, you know, surround yourself with, with people that, that can offer, you know, a million different things, <coughs> people you trust. Um, you okay? Yeah. Okay. Um, you know, and, and if you work together, a, a great collaboration, which this has been the whole time, you really can see a lot of you know, I mean, we're here, we're at AFI, great film festival, we're, you know, excited to be here. Um, but yeah, I mean, we, we made this movie in 19 days, you know, I mean, it, there's Hollywood films out there that take six months to shoot, and with budgets that are ridiculous, and, you know, I don't think they come close to this movie. You know, we're independent filmmakers, and uh, it feels good to say that we made this movie independently. And I think that AFI is a great market for that. I mean, I and we're the only American film in the festival and the and the the competition. So that that's cool. You know, I mean, we're representing we're representing the United States, man. That's great. I'm gonna kill everybody when I get. Sorry. What? What was that? Was my impression of John McCain, who I'm voting for, to lick my. Whoa, dude.